The other thing that happened with Elon Musk on Twitter today was we talked yesterday about Elon Musk's tweets about uh, we need it, uh, Ukraine needs to sign a peace deal with Putin, and he proposed a particular peace deal. And, uh, uh, you know, it's too dangerous to fight the Russians. We need to appease them. We need to kind of deal with them. Anyway, um, he was challenged by uh, Gary Kasparov, the, 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 maybe the greatest chess player ever, but, but certainly a world champion in chess, who has been, since he retired from chess, a, a real um, advocate for uh, rights, for liberty, and, and a, a, a real critic of Vladimir Putin and the regime in Russia, uh, and, and a real opponent of the regime in Russia. Anyway, uh, he was so Elon Musk was criticized by um, by uh, the chess master uh, by Kasparov, and um, Elon Musk's response was pretty pathetic. So I told you yesterday he sounded like Jordan Peterson. This sounded like I don't know what this sounded like a sport brat. He email he, he tweeted back to Kasparov. He said, um, "Well, I, I supplied." The Ukrainians with the with the satellite internet, it cost me eighty million dollars. Money I lost, I think actually the Biden administration paid for the for all those sat uh, satellites. But anyway, um, I lost money. What have you done except tweet? We're talking about one of the most uh, well known Russian dissidents in the world. We're talking about somebody whose life has been threatened regularly. We're talking about somebody who is basically left his country, Russia, and can never go back. We're talking about somebody whose friends and associates have been attacked by Putin. Some of them had been poisoned and killed. We're talking about somebody who lives with the fear that Putin's going to kill him. But oh no, he doesn't do anything except tweet. We're talking about somebody who's been fighting against Putin, against Putin's authoritarianism, against this thuggery. for over a decade now. We're talking about one of the, really the best voices out there for, you know, not, not objectivism and not uh, complete freedom, but certainly for greater freedom, certainly in countries like Russia. And Elon Musk is uh, so childish as to attack him is just an armchair commentator. It really is pretty pathetic. So my opinion of Musk over the last two days has dropped significantly, significantly. Um, he, he is clearly under the influence of people like J.P. Mo uh, JP Morgan, um, Jordan Peterson. Uh, he is c behaving like a child. He can't handle criticism. It's a little pathetic. It's a little pathetic. So while I'm still excited about him by Twitter, um, his views on Russia are pretty disgusting and awful, and you'd think he'd know better. Again, the Jordan Peterson-like, uh, and, and his response to Kasparov was terrible. So we'll have to keep an eye on Elon Musk, the very, very mixed character. Uh, I've, been, I've been hot and cold on Musk forever. Right, uh, you know, he 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 of uh, the car made of subsidies, and uh, he, he sometimes has great one-liners, and sometimes he makes a complete idiot of himself, like he is right now. So we will see. We'll keep you posted. We'll keep monitoring the situation with uh, Mr. Musk as we uh, as we go along. With uh... all right, let's. Thank you for listening or watching The Iran Brooks Show. If you'd like to support the show, we make it as easy as possible for you to trade with me. You get value from listening. You get value from watching. Show your appreciation. You can do that by going to iranbrookshow.com slash support, by going to Patreon, Subscribestar, Locals, and just making an appropriate contribution uh, on any one, of those, uh, any one of those channels. Also, if you'd like to see The Iran Brooks Show grow, please consider sharing our content, and of course, subscribe. Press that little bell button right down there on YouTube so that you get an announcement when we go live. And for those of you 
who are ready subscribers and those of you who are ready supporters of the show, thank you. I very much appreciate it.